Was up here? Yeah, I mean, I think a little bit disappointed in the end. We had one or two little opportunities. Obviously, they've had a couple of inter- opportunities as well, but I think we probably had the major ones. Um, certainly, Graham Montgomery's chance in the first half to keep him made an absolute worldy save. And obviously, Davey Moley had a couple of chances. One in the first half, he just didn't quite react quick enough. Um, and, the, and the shot he's had in the second half that's just gone past the post. So, But I felt overall, probably, the draw was probably a fair result. Um, I felt two two teams had a real go at each other there today and uh, it was probably a good cup tie to watch. Um, a little bit exciting, I think, and I was just pleased we hung on in the end and got, got a draw and obviously got the opportunity to go and have another go at them. Yeah, sure, sure. Exactly. In terms of a good cup tie, that's exactly what it was. It was a good old yeah, good and, uh, and that's what we wanted to make it. As I said to the, the players before, I don't have any regrets at the end of the day. I don't want you to come sit in this change room afterwards and feel that you could have done a little bit better. And I felt every single one of them gave us everything they had and uh, they didn't leave anything uh, in the changing room. Uh, and they give us everything they had on the pitch and certainly I felt in the last 10-15 minutes we got a little bit tired, we started to get a little bit deeper and they had more possession of the ball but they never really, apart from maybe one or two half chances, they never really opened us up. Yeah. And uh, my grand Kevin said that he felt his side but yeah, quite lax in the possession, too many touches and caught between the game. Do you think it was an element to them uh, underestimating Boromir today? Um, and that was the one thing we did say, that if they did underestimate us, we might be able to catch them out. Um, so um, I think you've also got to give us a little bit of credit from the way we went and, went and closed them down. Certainly my two midfield players, Luke Garrett and Sam Cox, I thought had excellent games. You know, they were they were in and around them the whole time. They, they won a lot of first and second balls. and. We managed to get the ball out to Graham Montgomery probably more than to the, to the Greg Morgan. And uh, as I say, it was just one of them games where, you know, it was just a little bit of a cup tie. Maybe if the league game it'll be a little bit slower and maybe in his his league, he's planning, probably you might get a little bit more time on the ball than what you do in this league. And certainly I felt my two midfield players really got about the park. Long old trip though, of course, in the ring. <laughs> Long old trip, and that's what I was just saying earlier, you know, in the, the whole squad now, you know, obviously we've got some players work at the club full time, but certainly for myself and, and some of the the other guys involved, they've got to try and obviously get two days off work now. Um, and we've obviously got to try and decide whether we go by train or whether we go by coach. What days do we go up? Um, obviously the game's on the Tuesday night, so yeah. it's just about some of the, the players getting them days free now and make sure we prepare properly and... Uh, as I said earlier, I don't want to go up there and just make the numbers up. You know, we'll know we've got tomorrow in the draw, and let's let's be positive and, and go up there and try and win the game. Will we have a full squad, you think? We'll have a full squad. We've got Mark Jones suspended um, but next but Saturday. Travel, we'll I, I think we've got to decide that this yeah. week. Hopefully, most of the players have got jobs where they're going to be quite lenient. I mean, obviously, Mark Jones. Um, he had a few weeks off with, with, to get married um, at the part of the season, so hopefully he hasn't used all his holiday up. Um, and there's one or two others like that, but hopefully from that side of it, we, you know, we will have a full squad to choose from. And it's nice being there, you know, in the hat tomorrow for draws. Any team in particular that you quite fancy to, you know, to, just, to lure for the, for the replay? Obviously, I think if you're going to look at Wolves or Sheffield United or even Luton, you know, you're going to get a good crowd and a, and a great atmosphere. But anybody here, I feel, would be great for the town and great for the club. I mean, you see what we're doing with the stand now. It's coming along lovely. The chairman's done a fantastic job for that side of it. And the more publicity we can give the football club, the more crowd we can get in. And that's what we've got to try and strive to do. And the only way we can do that is getting the publicity from you guys and, and showing people what we can do. From the football side of it, we, we think we've got a good team. Uh, but the league position at the moment shows that we haven't because we've, we've underperformed in that league. But you know, we've had a few excuses with the injuries we had early on. We've got everybody back now. And, and I think the quality of the football is starting to show. You'll be OK work-wise, will you? Hopefully so, yeah, I'll be fine, I think. Uh, my boss has been quite good from that side of it and uh, I think I've still got some holiday to take, so I'll take it now instead of taking it at Christmas. <laughs> good stuff, thank you. Very thank much. you very much, no problem, cheers, thank you.